Hello and welcome to Pay Buddy, Mr. D here, and welcome to today's video, Biomechanics for Beginners. This is the first video in a five part series where we're gonna dive into what is biomechanics, kinetic concepts, kinematic concepts, levers, and principles of equilibrium. In today's video, we'll learn what biomechanics actually is. Let's get into it. So what is biomechanics? If we break the word down, bio means life or living things. Mechanics means machines. So if we put that together, the Oxford Dictionary defines it as the study of mechanical laws relating to the movement or structure of living organisms. What does that mean and what does that include? So these are some of the concepts and ideas that we'll go through in this video series. So they include kinetic concepts, Newton's laws of motion, kinematic concept of human movement, projectile motion, principles of equilibrium and levers. So why is this useful? Why do you need to know it? So a theoretical measured data-driven approach to analyze and understand movement is the best way to improve athletic performance and also decrease injuries. This takes the guesswork out and touches on science and physics and other relevant fields. This is a more scientific approach to athletic performance. So what does that actually look like? So in this example here, we've got a guy running on a treadmill. Now we can look at this through a number of different lenses. We can watch him and we can say, yes, he looks like he's running well. He can keep running and he'll improve. Or we can take a more measured analytical and scientific approach or a biomechanical analysis where we've hooked him up to a number of data gathering sources. And we can now apply things like Newton's laws, levers, force, mass, acceleration, and all of these different concepts to this athlete. Now we've got a structure or an organizational system where we can analyze his movement, decide where he's inefficient and where he performs well, and then we can use this data-driven information to improve his performance. Pretty cool, right? In the next few videos, we'll dive into exactly what this looks like and how it works. That's it for the first introductory video to our Biomechanics for Beginners series. Make sure you like, comment and subscribe for more and stay tuned for our next video. Thanks everybody, see you next time.